Hello again, we're back with experiment number three. This is Hamid Reza Bissi alongside. Salam from the Monica. We'll be performing the seam analysis known as the degradation test. But before we get started, let's get to know the equipment we're going to use today. So, this is the equipment we're going to use today. We have the stack of seams involving the pan and the cover. We have the soil sample here, the rubber tip pestle. We have a balance of precision 0.1 grams and also at the end of the experiment we're going to use the mechanical stitch taker and the oven. So the first step is to take a sample of this oven dry soil sample and put it into the rubber tip pestle and try to break it into individual particles. So something we should notice is that the idea is to break the soil particle into individual particles, not to break the particles themselves. So the next step would be to pour the sample into the stack of seeds that we prepared. But something we should notice again is that the seed at the top has a larger opening. So after pouring the soil sample we prepared, we place the cover on the top of the stack of seeds and we run the stack of sieves through a sieve shaker. So after about 10 to 15 minutes, we stop the sieve shaker and remove the stack of sieves. After removing the stack of sieves, we weigh the amount of soil retained on each sieve and the bottom pan. So after using the shaker for about 15 minutes, we weigh the amount of soil retained on each sieve as you could see so we weigh each sieve separately but we shouldn't forget to subtract the weight of each sieve from it therefore to get the person retained we have to divide the mass retained over the total mass but something we should notice is that the soil retained in the pan are actually silt and clay particles thanks for your time we'll be sure to be back with another experiment